in XY mode, uh, the voltage of one input is plotted against the voltage of another input. So here I have two function generators. I have an analog, uh, just a regular uh, analog adjustment one here, and I have a nicer digital one here. And I can uh, set the frequencies of the inputs and you know get it, the frequency the same and get them out of phase, and it'll actually uh, trace the path of those voltage belts to each other. Uh, all right, so the easiest thing to do is to sort of let this old one drift where it's going to drift and then set uh, the frequency on the digital one. So we're just going to frequency and we're at 20.086 kilohertz. There you go. So we can actually set this up to act as a digital integrator uh, where it will find the area of that curve. And so we can use the Lisa Zhao method where we put a, uh, a very large capacitor in series with the capacitance of our dielectric barrier discharge. This is a, a helium plasma jet. Um, I'll actually be able to estimate uh, the power dissipation in the plasma uh, by the area of this. So you can see already this old analog thing has, has drifted out of spec again. Uh, let's see here. Frequency, now we're down to 20.08 kilohertz. There we go. So if they were perfectly in sync, if the frequencies are perfectly in sync, uh, that would be, the shape would be stable. The area would be stable. Uh, but not only out of phase, but the frequency of this is also dropping over time, uh, so it'll move faster and faster.